From personal experience, defenseless plant lice know how useful a bodyguard is. That's why they pay highly for this service. By providing the ants with a very nutritious sugary liquid, in return they obtain the security of having bodyguards and escorts at their disposal. At the slightest sign of danger, the ants will react like a man defending his protege. But only due to self-interest, of course. Ants are mercenaries. The sense of duty is man's prerogative. Ants have become such a well-organized allied army that some plants have decided to hire their services so that they're not devoured by insects, as well as to avoid being invaded by more aggressive plants. This type of acacia in Costa Rica is known as the cornisuelo, or bullhorn acacia. It's evolved parallel to a species of ants. It's one of the best symbiotic relationships known today. In return for their protection, the plant provides its bodyguards with room and board. Its strong thorns are hollow, which is where the ants live. They also use the thorns to store their food and to breed their offspring, and they use them as their bedrooms. It's an atypical anthill, in which the different sections are independent rooms connected not by tunnels, but by the tree's branches. This immense labyrinth is conveniently marked by pheromones in a way that each ant can recognize its path and go where its work takes it. The tree thorns are also a good defense, which means that the ants are also protected by their client. You watch my back and I'll watch yours, as the saying goes. But the ants live on the acacia especially for their payment, or better yet, the food. The tree secretes a liquid for the ants. These tiny springs are equally distributed among the branches. The ants can drink from them to obtain the calories they need to survive. The care offered by the acacia is such that the ants do not need to look for any other resources. They never leave the tree. In certain periods, the plant produces a kind of pill rich in proteins at the tip of the leaves, which completes the nutritional needs of the entire colony, including the queen and the larvae. These prepared food packs are very similar to the modern energy bars eaten by humans, which include an adequate proportion of carbohydrates, fats, and proteins. The question is that the guardian who protects the tree doesn't leave his post, not even to eat. What happens is that anyone who dares to approach the acacia is dangerously attacked because this species of ant also has a very strong poison. Surprisingly, we discovered a worm peacefully strolling among the ants. Even in the middle of this fury caused by another insect, they didn't seem to notice it. The ants didn't detect the worm, and if they came into contact with it, they quickly became immobilized. Its protective shield must be like a chemical costume, but this kind of invention is not within a human being's reach. <laughs>